you guys hey guys it's your girl kayla b you know me and i'm coming at you with another video i guess another video and it is empties yes this is my empties for january and february of 2022 and let's get into this i was in like a lot of hand soap candle phase a lot of bath and body works let's just get it into it all right <laughs> first this is a candle from marshall's this is a pineapple and geranium travel juicy and sweet this smelled like amazing this is from dw home oh i can still smell it in here like i literally use it to the bottom like mm. oh and it was one of the um those those fire wigs like i love that the crackle and it just feels like you're by the fire smelling something amazing <sighs> now the second candle this i got from tj maxx and you can still get this this is in their store it's i don't know what brand it is i guess oh it says right here threshold it's the threshold brand this was like very very cheap and i was like ooh, coconut anything coconut i'm like down for it this coconut sorbet like this really smells like coconut and lime oh it smells like tropical it smells like you know what it smells like the coconut ices you know the coconut ices from the stands not the the one with the shave ice the actual like ices ices you know the ones that they be giving you scoops of yeah this smells like the coconut one oh that smells like co that smells like it that's the reason why i liked it i should have got the bigger one because this i believe was like 250 and i was like oh 250 for a small candle and that's really cool because you know these and sephora's be like 20 dollars, 25 close to like 30 and this and the other candle be big nah so i was like you know what let me get this let me try this out so i'm definitely buying the bigger one next time i go to tj maxx all right for the third candle and last candle we have cinnamon caramel swirl this is like my favorite i definitely finished this at the end of december beginning of january and this definitely smells like cinnamon buns it smells like cinnamon buns so much oh i love it i love it i love it i hope they come out with it again next year because this was my favorite holiday candle like usually it's peppermint but this was my favorite one it smells literally like cinnamon buns literally then you guys know champagne toast love this room spray after the candles was done i was just using this as room spray and um it's out I love champagne toast. I'm currently using champagne toast body wash, so and hand soap. So, yeah. Next thing is pear, pear, pear berry. I was like, I about to say peach berry. Every time I said pear, I was thinking about peach, but pear berry. I love this scent. I love it. Oh, I have the um the lotion. I'm still using, but this was really, really good. Um, but this also irritated me. The lotion doesn't irritate me, but this irritated me down there. Um, so I cannot have that down there. Like, I had to use it only for my up top area. And, yeah, that's, that's it. So, some Bath & Body Works body washes do not agree with my whole body. I never knew that because I never got this in the body wash i always got it in the lotion so i wouldn't know i wouldn't know i just can't have it around my private parts anyways the key notes is anju pear wild berries apple blossom um golden fresca blonde woods that's cool it says the perfect blend of juicy pears and wild berries. It really is. It smells really good. But I just heard it down here. And that was no, no bueno. No bueno. Anyways, like I said, favorite thing for holiday, Twisted Peppermint. I finished this in the beginning of January. And then I started this one. Um, and in February, um, this is the Ulta Autumn Punch. And then I started a new one at the end of February and now into March. So, yeah. So, this is... My sister peppermint. I love this. This is from White Barn. This is the that's the nice part of Bath and Body Works, you know, with the candles and stuff. And this is from Ulta Beauty. 
I, this is their fall, I think fall thing. Was it fall or was it winter? It was one of them. I just know I got it on sale. So, you. And I also love foaming. If you really, if you actually pay attention, both of them are foam. That's like the only like I love, I love foam hand soaps. Like I don't know, I don't know. That's just a me thing. I love foam hand soaps. I think that's just fun. That it lathers up very well, and I just feel so relaxing. <laughs> All right, for moisturizer, I finished up my Ola Hendrickson moisturizer. I mean, you can still see that I have some left. It's just there's no way I'm getting to it. Like no way. Like I scrape it up, but like it's done. It's it's done. It is done and it's time to go. This was really, really good. This was really good during the dry wintry months as a day moisturizer, not as a night moisturizer to do the whole cleaning and cleansing and calm thing and restoring elasticity and moisture to the skin during while you're sleeping no this is a good um makeup uh moisturizer under makeup because it made my pores look reduced this was just a, overall a good moisturizer if you have oily skin or combo skin i usually have combo skin during like the hot months and also um going into spring like right now i would have loved this so yeah I really did like it. It's Ola Henderson. Like I, that's one of the brands that I don't have any problems with. It's Ola Henderson. I love everything in there, in that brand. So, unless wait, does it have something banana? If it has something banana, then no, because I don't do banana. I'm allergic to banana. I don't do banana. Ugh. Anyways, for mascara, we had the Ciate Triple Shot XL Mascara and the Tristique Mascara. I actually like the Tristique Mascara, even though, yeah, that's like all totally dry. It was done. Even though, like, it only lengthens. It doesn't volumize. I would have to do this for volume. Like, I would have to mix them both, and they made a great lash, but I just don't like something that I have to mix. I just want one thing. What is my cat doing back there? He's doing the most. Anyways, that's my thoughts on the mascaras. Now, this I got from um, BoxyCharm a while ago. Some people just got it in their February bag. But I got this for a little while ago, like a couple months ago. This is the Clara Serum um, RT Retinol Stimulating Targeting Treatment Luminous Complexion. Um, this is actually good. It didn't break me out. It did give me a luminous complexion. It did help me with some of my fine lines and it smoothed out my face. So it does work. It just, it takes forever to see the results. Like I had to get up to here to start seeing results. And that's like when you're almost done with a thing and you're like, oh, now I'm seeing results. Oh, I should buy another one. No. I want something like you see results after halfway, not 75% halfway or a little bit of 25%. Like I just, I want faster results, but that's everybody though. That's everybody. And also this I believe is cheaper than a regular serum. So what is he doing? Now you look at him. Now you looking at him. Now he looking at the microwave. He's doing so much. Anyways, this right here is my favorite lip scrub. But now Polly Bomb has my favorite lip scrub. Like this used to be my favorite. Like I just this is my third time I ever bought Naked Cosmetics lip scrub. Like I don't like their. What are you trying to do? I don't like their eyeshadow eye pigments. I don't like anything else, but I don't like I don't like making cosmetic stuff.
but I do like their lip scrubs. That's all I can say. Like, when you say nigga cosmetic, I'll be like, oh, yeah, I love their lip scrubs. The lip scrubs are my favorite thing. Yeah, I love them. They, they, they exfoliate my lips. They have a nice vanilla scent. They also have a peppermint one. They made a peppermint one for December um, for, for Christmas and the winter months. And also, it just makes my lips feel so nourished. Like, I love it. I love their stuff. And it's easy to clean off. Like, I literally could be a spokesperson for NYX Cosmetics Lip Scrub. Get your lips off. But yeah, so. That's the only thing I like from NYX Cosmetics, though. That is the truth. And I try a lot of stuff from NYX Cosmetics. AKA Ipsy. Through Ipsy. And that's the only thing I actually kept on buying and actually liked. So that's it for this video. I hope you guys liked it. Have a Now you're on the stove. Now it's going to be a freaking problem. I had to spray him with some water. I didn't want to do it, but I had to, I had to do it. <sighs> Anyways, have a great day. Have a great night whenever you're watching this. Video right here, video right here, head right here. Go check it out. And also, all my social media and how to contact me and everything else is down below. So go check it out and have some fun. And I'm about to kill him because I think he's scratching up my chair, my sofa. Luckily, I have plastic on it because I didn't want it to get fucked up in the mouth. I just put my couch in here. You he stop scratching it. My cat is crazy, y'all. <laughs>